Right, in my video today, I'm going to show you how to start using OpenBOM. OpenBOM is a powerful online system that helps you to manage parts, bill of materials, and organize product structure. So let's start first from creating a catalog to keep parts. That's the first thing that you need to do. You can use one of the catalogs that you already have in the system and you can get access to this in all catalogs. When you create a new account, you have all these demo catalogs. Don't pay attention for this now, just create a new catalog. So let's create a catalog for parts and I will call the my shop items. So at the same time, you can create a simple part number setup. Uh, so for part, simplest part number setup, we create part number template, which will include prefix, a range of the part numbers, and uh, that's pretty much what we need by creating the catalog. So I have an empty catalog to manage my shop items. I can manage I can create as many catalogs as I want, but let's start first. This catalog, it's completely flexible, so you can define what properties, what attributes for each part you want to create. And the OpenBOM comes with a few default, like you can see image, cost, description. So let's, uh, you can add any property using the Add Property menu. So let's add supplier name. So you can see I can add any property. I can add, for example, unit of measure. So once I have the properties, I can add item information. So let's say first item, it's gonna be a, um, a screw. And the cost gonna be like 20 cents. Now, and uh, um, I'm, I will need an images, but I will take care, care of images uh, later on and the unit of measure will be each. So let's take another part and it's gonna be a wheel. And the cost gonna be $2, 10 cents, and the unit of measure will be each. So let's create a third part and that's going to be a deck and of course going to be two dollars and seventy cents and uh, that's going to be each so you see i created three parts so now what i need uh, it's also i need to create an item for my product so i create an item for my product which is going to be a skateboard Uh, we will figure out what will be cost of the skateboard later and the unit of measure will be each as well. So what I can do now is that I can create bill materials for the skateboard. So I can navigate on the open items bomb. Now this bomb doesn't exist, so I can create the bomb. And I'm telling that I will be using the shop items for this bomb. So I created bill materials. So what I would like to do now for this bill of materials is that I would like to add uh, items. So I'm basically building my product and building my skateboard. So I can select items based on the part number just by typing, but I can use search. So in the search, I can decide I'm using screw and I insert it in a bomb and I will need uh, 10 screws. And I am adding now um, deck. And uh, I am adding a uh, wheel. So pretty much I created a bomb with the three components. And uh, I have this all information. So I can say, well, I have four wheels and I have one deck. 
So what is uh, missing now uh, is uh, to calculate the cost. So I can put the formula by editing formula and uh, I forgot to start my uh, trial version so I can start the free trial uh, and uh, I put the information about the company I put the type of user the phone number company size I got this free trial now so I can continue to use premium features because that was free account that I created from the beginning so extended cost is the formula so now I can create a formula for calculating of the cost and uh, that's gonna be quantity times cost that's it I got the formula I got the calculation you can see a formula it's reflected here and I want to see the total so I click on the total and I enable troll up total that's my cost so what is missing here some final touches I would like to have a visual bill of materials and open bone gives this option to me but what I need to do I need to go to the uh, catalog and put those images so I can do it in a couple of ways so first I can always navigate to the catalog through the item information panel just click link and I'm opening another tab in the browser with uh, item information so now I have images the easiest way to put images in open bomb is copy paste so let's search for skateboard image online just keep in mind don't use uh, illegal images so but for your information now we can use this um, this skateboard and uh, I put this uh, image here so now we can go and look for the skateboard uh, deck so let's say that's the image that I want so that's gonna be a deck I would like to have a skateboard wheel so let's use this wheel and uh, I need a screw so a screw I just want to show you another way to get this information if I am in my bomb I can tap in the item and I can edit it from the item info so I can edit this and I can find for screw on my disk I have a screw that's gonna be the screw that I like to have and I save this item information information is saved in catalog as well so you can see we get a visual bomb we get images we get information we get cost and uh, this is your first step how to create bill of materials and manage items information in open bomb uh, navigate to learn more about open bomb in our help and training session where you can learn everything about open bomb and get access to the um, help documentation and other useful information and that was all with open bomb first bomb and catalog creations talk to you soon bye, -bye.